Shifting gears to domestic politics, representatives from the ruling and main opposition parties took a trip to the National Archives to settle their differences over comments made by the late former President No Mu Hyun during his 2007 summit with North Korea. That issue is whether his statements about the defective maritime border between the two Koreas were controversial. Kim Hyun Ji has more on how far legislators got today in resolving this conflict. On Monday, 10 representatives from the ruling Sanduri Party and main opposition Democratic Party visited the National Archives of Korea in Seongnam, Gyeonggi Province. There, they looked at the list of 2007 inter-Korean summit documents the archives had picked for them based on the seven keywords provided in advance by the lawmakers. The summit materials are classified, but earlier this month, the National Assembly voted in favor of giving lawmakers access to the minutes and voice recordings from meetings between former South Korean President No Mu Hyun and former North Korean leader Kim Jong Il. The rival parties now hope to settle the question of what President No said about the western maritime border between the two Koreas, known as the Northern Limit Line. Some members of the Senuri Party have claimed President No tried to give up the NLL to North Korea during the 2007 summit. The Democratic Party, however, rejects that claim and argues that President No had only proposed creating a peace zone around the NLL with a joint maritime patrol. The National Archives of Korea was supposed to send the documents that the lawmakers had picked to the National Assembly on Monday afternoon. But this did not happen because the lawmakers were not satisfied with the list of documents provided. They will visit the archives again on Wednesday, and they provided additional keywords to produce more documents related to the 2007 summit. Once the copies of the documents arrive at the National Assembly, which will be later this week, they will be locked up in a safe at a House Steering Committee meeting room. Once the 10 lawmakers go over the materials, they will decide among themselves what to report to House Steering Committee members. And that is the information that will ultimately be disclosed to the public. Kim Hyun-ji, Arirang News.